I can tell you that working with the Harwood Institute has been the fundamental thing that's made me better as a leader of United Way. Prior to starting work with the Harwood Institute in Battle Creek, we were and continue to be a community of rich history. Families work hard and they typically know each other. At the same time, we found that the difference between uh, disparate populations and those of us who were leading institutions and organizations really trying to help in the social sector were feeling disconnected. So we found the Harwood Institute in partnership with United Way Worldwide and we really looked at, so what's our aspiration for the community around education? They encouraged us to go out and have community conversations, the kitchen table conversations as Rich likes to say, and we kind of thought that that was pretty trivial. Uh, I remember uh, sitting with our leadership team at United Way thinking, well, how's this going to influence uh, ultimately the outcomes for kids in their education? And we said, well, trust the process. Let's try it out. Uh, for example, when we talked to teachers, we heard them say, we wish we had better relationships with parents. And when we talked with parents, they said, we wish we had better relationships with teachers. And when we talked to administrators, they said, we wish there was better relationships going on between our parents and our teachers. And so the early wins were like, well, that should be simple enough. Let's have a dinner and let's invite them in and let's bring their kids in. And what we found quickly is parents and teachers and administrators were sitting down together. They were building relationships right away. But I come to everything fairly analytical. And so what the Harwood Institute and, and working with the team has meant is I don't show up as analytical anymore. I don't show up as everything has got a clear solution. And so I think that's been really important that we're doing things with people, not to people. The ripples that have been created over the last uh, 10 years now of working with the Harwood Institute in Battle Creek have been the education indicators are improving. More kids are ready for kindergarten, more kids are reading proficient by third grade, and ultimately we'll see uh, to our 15-year goals improvements in graduation rates. I think the other thing that we're seeing in terms of success is we're seeing a culture in the Battle Creek community uh, of norms and values being influenced by uh, the importance of community engagement. I went to a Harwood Summit and uh, the opening evening, Rich um, came out and talked about the theme for the summit and the theme was love. And I remember thinking to myself, I've just spent this time and resources to come and talk about love. And how's that going to impact the work that I do or the person that I am as a leader? And it was a profound impact over the next couple of days because it really focused in on why we do this work, why we help each other in communities, why we care about one another uh, and build the humanity that we can all be proud of. And I think especially now we need more love. I grew up playing Little League Baseball. And I remember with my grandparents and my parents and aunts and uncles there, I was typically had more people cheering me on than the rest of the team combined. The Harwood Institute is about creating that for everybody in our community and creating the opportunity for people to be supported so they can be their most successful selves.